everyone, it's Shell Me and welcome to my YouTube channel, Love for Special Thinkers. Today's video is going to be my first vlog. And so today's vlog, I will be working around my house and doing a little sped prep Sunday. So if you're interested in my sped prep Sunday, stay tuned and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. All right guys, so the first thing I am working on is mailing some letters to my team if you do not know i am special education team leader on my campus so i am working on mailing some letters to my team this is um what i will be mailing they are just a little welcome letter that just says visuals data patience and love it says welcome to our school's 2020-2021 sped squad and, and then it just says love me so I printed everyone's paper. This is going to both teachers and paraprofessionals on pretty Astro Bright. And I just have some white envelopes and then I'm also putting some confetti inside. I is prepping my sped teacher binders if you watch my Amazon haul and I'll link the video right here but if you watch my Amazon haul you saw that I got this binder from uh, Amy Tangerine and I said I was going to use this as my teacher binder so I made a virtual binder for the rest of the special education team members on my team through Google Slides and if you follow me on Instagram it is in my story highlight so go to my Instagram love for special thinkers and check out that video um, but I made a virtual teacher binder but I also made it where I could save it as a PDF and print it because I am a paper pencil person myself I don't really I don't dislike virtual but as far as like writing things out and collecting data and that sort of thing I like to do it uh, you know paper and pencil so what I did was I saved it as a PDF and I printed it all on um, bright colored Astro Brights to go with my bright color binder. So, um, I have table of contents, my caseload form. I didn't print with the lines. I don't know why, because I printed in black and white and not in color, because I was printed on color paper. So, I don't know why that messed up, but uh, IEPFIE due dates, a calendar for the IEP meetings and just different checklists and forms um, that I made. Like I said, go check out my Instagram so that you guys can see exactly what's in the binder and how I made it virtual, but I am gonna do it old school. And so I also bought these dividers from Amy Tangerine. And so what's gonna go behind my first tab is all of this stuff. calls to parents on campus and let them know of the programs and supports and all that fun stuff that we're going to offer when we start school on August 17th. So I spent major so I spent majority of the day on the phone um, and then I just kind of relaxed. I've been watching Love on the Spectrum. If you guys haven't watched that and you're looking for something good to watch, check out Love on the Spectrum on Netflix it's about uh, adults with autism uh, kind of navigating dating and it's super cute and like I smile like the entire time I watch it I'm only on episode three it's only one season so I'm not sure how many episodes there are but I'm on episode three and I think that that show is super cute but to do a little planning because I registered for a couple of trainings for next week like our so like we go back to work officially Thursday and so um, I registered for a couple of plannings today and um, I wanted to go ahead and put them in my planner and so 
since I have to put my trainings in my planner, I decided to go ahead and start planning for the whole month of August. Not so much like lesson planning, just work planning like with my PD days and all that fun stuff. So I'm gonna show a little clip of me planning. about to show you what the finished product of my planner looks like but these little sticky notes that you saw me using uh, I think I got these from Walmart for like $3.97 or $2.97 or something and they're super cute and so I'm using those within my planner because sometimes um, well not sometimes these boxes are extremely small with my planner so I bought those sticky notes to kind of add for the days that I have a lot to add to my planner. Um, and this washi tape, I think I mentioned that earlier, this washi tape came from Walmart as well. Yeah, Walmart, but it doesn't have a price. I want to say this is like $2.97 or $3.97 or something like that. And then the planner that I am using is from my Amazon haul. Um, if you haven't checked that video out, I'll link it right here. But that planner is the schoolgirl style planner. Wake up, teach kids, be awesome. So this is the planner that I am using. And the stickers that you'll see in this planner are also linked in my Amazon haul. And um, they're from Essentials, I believe. Yeah, teacher planner stickers. From essentials and it's just a ton of stickers so let me show you a clip of my planner so far it's August so far so this is where we are today and tomorrow's a pretty big day so yeah so I made it into my new classroom uh, same campus different classroom this is gonna be an inclusion and resource classroom so I will kind of show y'all all my stuff nothing is set up <clears throat> I don't know if I'll be able to set up anything today I have some like paperwork work to do and I don't really want to be up here too long but I'll show y'all what my classroom looks like so far all right so that's the front door um and this is most of my stuff that I moved from my old classroom up the stairs I got plenty of storage um, our refrigerator and microwave are back there. Um, desk, phone, and the whiteboard. So, this is my classroom. All right, hi guys. I feel super unproductive uh, since I've been up here for about three hours. Um, well, I guess not unproductive. Like I said, I had to call a few parents and I had to document some things and send a couple emails out and that sort of thing. So not unproductive and I haven't really done anything with my setup. Let me show you what I did do because I need to leave. I'm starving. Haven't eaten all day. I feel like I'm about to pass out. So let me show you what I did do though in my classroom. So literally all I did was kind of go through and clean out some of the stuff from the other teacher, um, set up my technology, and literally that's it. I, it looks the exact same that it looked when I showed you guys this morning. So, yep, back at square one. So I'm going home though because I'm hungry and I need to eat. So, bye. Hi guys, so it is Wednesday still. Um, it is about 11.30 p.m. I actually go back to work. Uh, we start PDs tomorrow, all virtual, so I'll be working from home, but my sleep schedule is all messed up, so I started working on my Meet the Teacher Google Slides presentation, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I've been working on. All right, so this just says Meet Miss Sanders, um, so I have Get to Know Miss Sanders. Uh, a slide about Miss Sanders in elementary school, my favorite movies and shows, favorite books, and contact information. So it tells them to click on any of the clouds to to learn more about me. And this is my little Bitmoji saying welcome. 
So let's start with get to know me. Uh, it's just a picture of me and uh, where I went to college and that sort of thing. And then if you click return to main page, it'll take you back to the main page. Um, this will be Miss Sanders in elementary school. So this is a little blurb about me in elementary school. And then right here, I will have my mom send me my third grade pic. And so I'm gonna put a picture of myself in third grade right there. My favorite movies and shows, Lion King, Grey's Anatomy, This Is Us, Toy Story, Hercules, Blackish. Then there's my little bitmoji watching TV. And then again, return to main page. Then they could click on my favorite books. Um, and I tried to pick some books that kind of are on the ability level of the students that I'll be working with this year. So got Flat Stanley, Chrysanthemum, If You Give a Mouse a Cookie, Ralph S. Mouse, and the Junie B. Jones series. Return to main page.